So for the laser project that I'm working on, I've had to involve the physics department. I've been collaborating with a visiting physics professor here, Vince Rossi, who is currently finishing up his dissertation at OSU. And his dissertation work focuses on um, how different laser lights are diffracted by human bone. And so we thought it might be interesting to look and see how we can use these uh, different laser wavelengths to treat uh, bone cancer. And so our idea for this project was that we could uh, shoot bone cancer cells with lasers and destroy them. It's a, a novel treatment for osteosarcoma, which is bone cancer. And osteosarcoma is one of those cancers that's really common in children. And really the only treatment um, that's proven effective is amputation. So what we've decided to do is look at this novelizing agent, which we treat the cells with, and then we zap them with the laser light and watch them self-destruct. So it looks like you think these are necrosing. Do you have any idea why they're not necrosing? Well, I think the reason they're necrosing is because we're using too much light. Okay. Like, that's my first guess. Like, because we ramped up the amount of the photosensitizer that we're using, right, right to like 10 millimolars, which right. is a lot. I, I feel like medicine is really important and helps people. and. Um, that's probably what's kept my interest going. That and like when you do science, you're discovering things that nobody else knows. So it's like a secret, kind of. It's cool.